it's mid-afternoon and we're a little bit peckish. It's time for afternoon tea. I'm the NYC Traveler. Afternoon tea is a ritual that is associated with England. Usually it's served around 4 p.m., give or take an hour or so, and it's designed to hold you over until a proper dinner is served. As the English spread their empire around the world, for better or worse, the habit of taking tea at some point spread with them, for better, with many variations that developed with the local culture. In New York, it's now quite a thing, like brunch. We New Yorkers may not have invented brunch or afternoon tea, but we certainly have put our spin on it. Welcome to Alice's Tea Shop. Like many tea shops in New York, it has a literary theme, most notably Lewis Carroll's novel, Alice in Wonderland. The prices are pretty steep, no pun intended, but in all fairness, we took home more than we ate. I even had a spare water bottle, and I took the tea with me. Everything was huge. Unlike typical nursery sandwiches or finger sandwiches, the sandwiches they served were full size, as well as the cakes and giant sized scones. I guess they don't call us the Big Apple for nothing. If tea isn't your thing, or if you're with a group that wants the full afternoon tea experience and you don't, there are other things on the menu that will serve well as lunch, or as luncheon as they used to say in the Gilded Age. There's also a to-go section, so you can have a snack or a scone and some tea to go, and there are plenty of teas to choose from. This shop on the west side was particularly cozy. It was small, and it felt really intimate as we had our afternoon tea. There weren't many people in the shop, and so we got a lot of attention from the waiter, and it was just a real great experience. So pop in in one of New York's tea shops and have a spot of tea. I'm the NYC Traveler. <laughs>